great to be out of quarantine for a start, and then um, yeah, now to be now to be back around around the team. I'm um, yeah thrilled to be here and, and looking forward to getting into it. And particularly, Mr. Charhol is ripping ripping bloke. Watching a lot on TV. Haven't played with him yet. Can't wait to. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm like just really looking forward to getting into it and, and spending time with everyone. Yeah, uh, we've got a a really well balanced squad, uh, and I think we've got a squad that suits a variety of conditions, which. You try and get, um, you know, when you're putting a squad together, but I think we've been able to achieve it this year. Um, obviously playing a lot of different venues, so we need that flexibility. But yeah, I, I really like the mix of established international players and, and a bit of youth and a bit of excitement as well. I think once we get to Chepok, we'll get a better idea. And now the Chepok wickets have changed. There's both red and black soil in the same ground. So for us, it's having to go there, assess the conditions and and... Definitely having me is an advantage because I can uh, be able to read the wickets faster, hopefully. Numbers definitely point more towards finger spin, so pace on the ball is going to be important with spin. I think definitely uh, uh, spin is going to play a role, especially yeah, with the heat uh, traditionally and Chepok. Uh, definitely even in the test series in England, we saw how much the wickets spun. And even in the IPL, traditionally wickets have spun a bit. So. The power scores around 150, so that tells you the amount Washi has come on in the last six months is phenomenal. His rise has been phenomenal. The confidence I've been having spoken to him uh, through Australia, coming back, he's been in touch. So the confidence level that he's uh, got, uh, I think, has been phenomenal. Even for guys like Saini and Siraj, the way they see themselves is completely different to what they were last year. And Chael is an XP, like he's the old pro, so you really. Uh, we know what we'll get from Chael is going to be very consistent, so that that's not a worry. But the rise of say Washi, Siraj, and Saini have been big for us. I mean, I spent a bit, lot of time with Maxi recently, and he's so pumped up because um, AB and Virat have both someone he looks up to, and he, he's just raring to play with them, and he just wants to soak in and learn, and you know, give his best for the team. So. That's the feedback I've got from him as well. So very excited for Maxi to be here. He's as keen as ever. His fate is running to go. So it'll be very exciting. Yeah, look, I think um, you know we looked at um, our middle overs, you know, from a batting perspective, and um, you know we felt we 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 had enough players at the top. But obviously with Virat moving to the top, we wanted um, someone through the middle to to ease the load a little bit on on AB. Um, and we know he's an X Factor player. We know he can change a game on its head. But we need to find a way of being able to unlock that, um, and that's certainly you know what we're keen to do. A lot of positives, and I could clearly see the strengths of uh, each and every batsman. So, uh, somebody like a Pawan, who's very, who's got a good reach, Sachin Baby again coming at the back end uh, and playing the role of a finisher really well. So he understands his game, can use the angle really well. Yeah, Azaruddin again a special talent because he has the ability to uh, hit those boundaries and hit those sixes, and he can do that at any phases, so that is his strength. Uh, Rajat Patidar again, a uh, very uh, compact player, is very correct, he has his own uh, strengths, uh, looks very good back foot player, so that is something that I noticed. And uh, KS Bharat, uh, he seems also to be a good all-round cricketer in the sense that uh, he is, uh, of course, used to opening the innings, but he's also developing his game around spin. And as far as Suyash is concerned, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, he is somebody who can really play shots all around the wicket and uh, he seems uh, to have gone one notch up uh, when we saw uh, whatever we saw of him in Bangalore. So obviously he's also worked hard during this interim period. So from all those uh, aspects, I think uh, these are encouraging signs for RCB.